Hey guys, you're watching Raylan, and for this week's video, I'm going to be doing an Ipsy Glam Box unboxing. So if you guys want to see what I got in my Ipsy Glam Box, sorry, this way, then continue watching. Before we get into anything, I haven't filmed in like a week or two because my cat has been missing. Um, he hasn't came home, my cat Harry. So at the end of this video, I'm going to put together like a little clip so you guys can see Harry. Um, I hope he rests in peace. He is definitely one of my best friends, and... I surely miss him every single day. Um, I went ahead and I wanted a new companion, so I got a kitten. Um, it's a girl. I haven't really named her yet. I don't know if I want to keep her. She is such a brat. Like, I don't really, I haven't bonded with her like I did with Harry. So, if I don't find a bond with her, I'm just going to find someone else who will love her. Like, I loved Harry because, yeah. Um, so, this is the new kitten. She just looks like this. Um, say hello. I don't really know if I like her. She's so hyper. Harry was very laid back compared to this one, so I don't really know if I like her or not, but um, I guess she'll do all right. She's very sweet, but she's just a little too hyper for my liking, so if it doesn't calm down, I'm not keeping her. Okay, so with all that being said, we're going to do a quick outfit of the day, and then we're going to get started in today's video. My outfit today, I'm just wearing this little, it's a girl thing t-shirt, and then I just have on some black Nike shorts, and I'm just keeping it casual because I live in Florida and it's really hot all of the time, so I just try to make sure I wear something that I'm not going to like die of the heat streak in. Yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started in today's video. Um, I have the Ipsy box here. I've had this for a little over a week. I had another video planned and then I ended up just not liking the video I had planned. So I just scratched it and I was like, I'll just do this video instead. So I'm just going to go ahead and open this. Um, this is going to be my very first time opening an Ipsy Glam box instead of a bag. So I'm kind of excited. These boxes run $25 for the box and usually ipsy bags are about 10 so that's kind of it's only 15 dollars more but if the products in there are better it may just be well worth it so first glance at the box i'm going to go ahead and open it up sorry i had to take the kitten outside she was just being too rambunctious so i had to like take her out of my room and when i did the box flew open like upside down of course so i'm just going to go ahead and open it and it says glam bag glam bag plus don't be pretty like them be pretty like you and it just looks like this in here um i do see a piece of foam that looks like it goes all the way around the box and then we just have this welcome to the block party looks like this um this is probably the pamphlet that talks about every single product we will be receiving so we're gonna go ahead and get started i'm so excited all right, so the first thing that I'm seeing in here is this cream, and this is a CEO hydration. Hold on, let me pull this chair up here so I can put this box down so I don't spill it again. This is a CEO vitamin C rich hydration cream, Sunday Riley, and this is 1.7 ounces. Um, this is a very nice container. This is a full size product, which is absolutely amazing. Not used to getting full size products in Ipsy bags, but I guess I'm paying a little bit more, so that makes sense to why. I'm going to open this up. Okay, so this smells like oranges. I'm not going to open this part up just because, but I kind of want to feel it. Okay, so it smells like an orange creamsicle, and I'm going to attempt to put some on my finger without getting it all over the place. Um, this definitely has the consistency of like a pudding, um, very smooth, hydrating. I don't know if this is like a face cream, but this stuff feels absolutely so moisturizing. I would definitely recommend this stuff if you like the smell of oranges. It says it's just a hydration cream, but I'm going to go ahead and read the pamphlet to see if you can apply it, like, if it's supposed to be applied on your hands, because the second I read hydration cream, I thought you're supposed to apply it, like, on your face, but I went and put it on my hands. Why? I don't know. Alright, let's see here. This originally retails for $65, and this is used for, okay, 
With a commitment to clean, to clean formulas and pure effective ingredients, Sunday Riley makes products for you that make you feel good about using. The moisturizer is infused with ultra potent vitamin C. I guess that's why it smells like oranges, vitamin C. I don't know. To help the skin fight damage and visibly brighten your skin while adding a dewy, voluminous glow. Massage into clean skin, AM or PM. So this probably can be used for your face or hands. It doesn't really say, um, but it retails for $65, and it just looks like that. So we're going to go ahead and move on into the next product. So the next thing I went ahead and pulled out of this box is just a 620, and this is like an eyeliner brush type of deal. Um, not really seeing. Okay, so this comes with a Hydra, a Suva Beauty Hydra Liner in Grease and a 26 brush set. So this is the Suva Beauty Hydra Liner and this is a cake eyeliner. It just looks like this and then it also comes with the matching brush here. So we're gonna go ahead and test out this eyeliner. Like I said, it is in the shade Grease. So hopefully it's dark, I'm not sure. It looks pretty dark right here. Um. The liner looks to be, I don't know, it's just, okay, so it's very, like, I don't really know, like, I've never used an eyeliner like this before, but it just looks like this, I'm not really sure, I probably will not be using this, only because I don't use eyeliners like this, I use the, like, the ones with the little you know like liquid liners I don't really use this kind of liner but it might be fun to try it's very pigmented um that's for sure and it's nice that it came with a little brush like this we're gonna go ahead and read the retail value of this for the set of this it retails for $26 and it's just this little deal set okay so the most excited thing I was happy to see in this box because I cheated online but I won't be doing that next time um there's this Terrace times ipsy um and I believe it's a little palette it just looks like so kind of cool um this palette let's see this Terrace times Paris X Ipsy Game on Eyeshadow Palette retails for $24, and it's just a palette, so I'm going to go ahead and open it. It comes with a little sleeve, and it's just green like this. It's got some cool triangle type things going on, which is kind of fun. And then when you open it up, it has got, ooh, it has some so pretty colors. So, if you look here, it's got, the first color is called Game Changer, then Game Day, Game Night, Stack It Up, Block Party, Game Over. And it just looks like this. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick swatch for you guys so we can see how pretty the colors actually are. So, the Game Changer color looks to be a mustard orange, but I wonder how it's going to pull up on my hand. Okay. Not very pigmented but that is all right. I don't know if y'all can see it. It's not very pigmented, but it'll buff. Okay, this one seems to be a bit more pigmented. Um, yes, that one's very pigmented. Maybe it's just the color of that orange one, but the pink one is definitely showing up. There's also Game Night, and this looks to be a like dark greeny sequin sparkle color I don't really know how to describe it but I'm gonna go ahead and put some on my pinky and we're gonna swatch it and this one seems to be very pigmented too because I didn't put that much on my pinky and it just applied very well onto my hand um, this is very very soft very soft shade and this one is in the shade stack it up let's see there you go um, we're gonna swatch stack it up over here. Um, that one's just a neutral color, not really a need to swatch that one. Um, I was really excited about the one called Block Party, and I'm gonna try and get it. It's very sequiny, um, sparkly. I love eyeshadows with sparkle. Um, I think it just dresses up any look. This one is very, very, very pretty. It's not really showing up well on my hand, but it's very pretty, just
just not paying attention. And the last one we have is just this dark color called Game Over. It's just a dark blue color and putting it on looks pretty pigmented to me. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe all these colors off my fingers really quick and I will be right back. Okay, so the palette, like we said, it retailed for about $25-ish, $24, something like that. Let me read it again. Um, I believe it said $24, which I like that palette. It works rather well. Uh, I like pretty, all the colors in there are pretty, except for a couple I probably won't use, but that's okay. I do like the palette, and I think it was a very nice thing to put into the Beauty Glam box deal i'm gonna go ahead and open up another let's see what else we have left in here um the next thing i'm seeing in here is this treza stick and this is a matte color shiny lip balm crayon so i'm gonna go ahead and open this up we're gonna see how much this retails for in just a second this is in the shade belize borax looks like that something like this um this retails for $25. It's a matte color and shiny lip crayon in Belize Bordox and a Grunshade Balm all in one. So we're going to go ahead and open this. This looks to be a dark color, which I really don't wear lip colors at all. I don't like dark lips. I'm more of like a nude lip kind of person if I'm wearing a lip, to be honest. So when you open this up, you open it up like this, and it says there's a balm inside on the sticker. No clue. Um, and then on the top, it's got like this cute little crayon type of effect here. Um, yeah, so it's just like a rolly crayon type of deal. I'm going to go ahead and this comes out like this. It's not as dark as I thought it was going to be, but it's still a little too dark for my liking. So I'll probably just find a friend that will wear this. Um, it is a pretty lip shade color. Just I don't wear stuff like this on my lips. So, that is a downside, and I believe there's one last product in here, so why don't we go ahead and take a look. Alright, so the last thing that is in this box is just a couple of masks, and we're going to go and see the retail value of these masks, and I'm going to tell you what they are. They just look like this. They're by Tula Skin Care, and they came in this nice little reusable pouch, which is good. Um, let's see here. Tula Skin Care Major Glow Cooling and Brightening Sheet Masks. For a set of three of these, it cost $26, and I believe they included three of them. So we're going to go ahead and open them up. It says to use them for five to ten minutes, then remove the mask and pat the remaining essence to absorb into your skin. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and open these. Probiotics and Superfoods. So these just look like this. They're just masks. Um, they look to be all the same scent which is good. Um, I love the color of these masks. I think they're so pretty. And yeah, so that is the last thing that is in my Glipsy, Glipsy, my Ipsy Glam box. Like, I don't know. I think it was pretty cool. They sent some pretty awesome products. Uh, definitely things that I can use this time. Like, I hate when I get a box and there's nothing in there that I'll use. And then I'm just like, well, why did I waste my money on this? Well, this is definitely not one of those boxes because every single thing in here I could use if I used it. If I'm not going to use it, somebody else will use it. So, that's a good thing. Um, I overall think for $25, it's well worth the price. Um, you do get a full-size palette, which is just worth it on its own. Um, you do get your money's worth. Um, there's a lot of cool things in here, and it's fun just to get a new box every month. Um, I do like Ipsy. I would rather have this box than the glam bag. Even though they don't give you a makeup bag with this box, I still like it better. Um, yeah. So now we're going to go ahead and take a moment of silence for my cat, Harry. I'm going to insert a couple pictures and videos of him so you guys can see how smart and intelligent he was. He was such a great cat, and... Sit, jump, now shake it. Alright guys, 
guys so that is everything I have for today I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs up anyways duh um anyways if you liked this video make sure you hit the subscribe button and the little bell to see upcoming videos just like this one I'm gonna link all my social media platforms down below for my TikTok, Poshmark, Mercari, Instagram, Snapchat you guys can find me all linked down below. I'm going to also link Ipsy down below. So if you guys want to get your own Glam Box, you can. I definitely think it's well worth it. Um, and that is everything I have for you guys today. Bye.